to Mark After Dark. I'm your host, Mark, and we are here after dark. Today, we are interviewing John Locke and Thomas Hobbes on their ideas of government. Hello, I am John Locke, and I believe in power to the people. Hello, I am Thomas Hobbes, and I believe in a strong central government. So, Locke, why do you believe that the power should be with the people? I believe that people are strong individuals and can speak their mind on laws that can be made. We need a strong power above the people, and some of the people can't be trusted with power. People should have a say in the government and also be able to throw it if they do not agree. Some people might have crazy ideas that no one believes in. That is the point in it. Everyone can have their own opinion on laws. Not everyone will agree on the same thing. Also, people have natural rights, which are life, liberty, and property. If they are not protected by the government, then the people can overthrow it. Well, I think if the government has the power, then laws can be passed quicker. Also, the government will be educated and will make good decisions that can benefit the country. Yes, laws will be passed faster, but not everyone will like the law, and they won't have any say. Just because someone is intelligent, that doesn't mean everyone will agree with them. If you believe the government should have the power because of intelligence, well, people can also be smart individuals. Some people may be intelligent, but some people aren't smart and could have crazy ideas. Well, even crazy ideas can be good ones. <clears throat> that was a good dispute between both philosophers. Vote now for who you think won, and for whether people or the government should have the power in government. Listen for the results after this short break. Have you heard of Thomas Paine? Well, come on down and get a copy of Common Sense by Tom and Thomas Paine. You will have the common sense to declare war and fight for your freedom to break free of Great Britain this summer of 1776. Are your things constantly getting stolen? Do you have trouble keeping your valuables in a safe place? Well, John's Lock is here to help you. Now, with John's locks, we have over 1,700 possible lock combinations, making it possible, impossible to have your things stolen. No longer will you have to constantly worry about losing your possessions, because John's locks is here to save the day. Well, folks, the results are in, and John Locke has won the debate by a landslide. 76% of our viewers voted for Locke, while only 24% voted for Hobbes. What do you have to say about your victory, John? Even before the debate, I felt good in myself, because I wouldn't think many people would want to vote for themselves not having any power. It makes me happy that I won by such a big difference. Wow, what a heated debate. Tune in next week for Thomas Paine explaining his new book, Common...